Now, your 41 NBC AccuWeather forecast, presented by Volume Chevrolet. Plenty of sun right now in Dublin. Looks like there's a couple thin clouds. That is it. Not seeing any cloud fields as of yet. And of course, it's calm in regards to our wind. It's most certainly hot though, 91 with a heat index of 98. And as I mentioned before, the wind is calm. You see a few clouds off to the south, but largely across Georgia right now it is clear in terms of our sky conditions. Now, one thing that we are dealing with until 8 p.m. is, of course, an excessive heat warning, and that is because of just the extreme heat we're expecting today. It's probably going to be the hottest afternoon that we see throughout the week already. Getting into lunchtime feels like temperatures for most of us are in the upper 90s, but by about 1230, we're looking at 100 plus for most locations. Well, it's going to be melting time as we get into the later hours of the afternoon. Look at this. Temperatures are going to be triple digits for the majority of the region. We'll check out our highs in just a second. Even with the humidity being this low, keep in mind, dew point that high means there's still a decent amount of moisture in the air. Don't be fooled by relative humidity. That's why it's called relative. It is going to feel absolutely miserable out there in regards uh, to just the extreme heat that we're dealing with. And even into tonight, the heat indices still going to be very, very hot. We are expecting some storms, but what's that going to do? It's going to add extra moisture, which, yeah, will get a little bit cooler because of that rain coming down and pulling in the cooler air from aloft, but that's going to add that extra moisture and make things a little bit more sticky. And so going to feel not very nice as we go through the overnight hours and into tomorrow morning either. Here are the highs for today. We are mainly seeing heat indices north of 105. So just Keep that in mind in terms of what to expect if you're going anywhere later. Unfortunately, there is a level two threat for severe weather today, and that's mainly revolving around hail. We're going to be seeing some small to medium sized hail in regards to storms that fire up later this evening and into tonight. Maybe some strong wind gusts, but in terms of tornadoes or flash flood, we don't really have to worry about either of those two things and continuing through the afternoon. The sun will be with us most of the day. We really don't see these storms begin to fire up until we get into those later evening hours and into tonight and you see some heavy central cores of these. That's where that hail is likely going to be. And again, that's just through the late evening hours into tonight by midnight. For the most part, the rain will be done. And as we head into tomorrow morning, we are going to be waking up to relatively clear conditions. However, again, it's going to feel a little bit sticky because of the added moisture from those storms. In 10 seconds, we're going to go ahead and look at your seven day forecast. At Volume Chevrolet, get oil changes for life, plus a 20 year, 200,000 mile warranty. Visit Volume Chevrolet, I 75 exit 187 in Forsyth. That's volumechevrolet.com. Your 41 NBC AccuWeather 7 day forecast is brought to you by Volume Chevrolet. Today is going to be our best chance of storms of the week. Tomorrow, very isolated. Friday, a bit of a mini cold front deal. Looks like it may come through in the late afternoon or evening hours. That could bring us a few storms. But the main thing that we'll do is, and we won't notice the heat change until the weekend, but Sunday will be the coolest day for Father's Day. But you see the low temperatures dropping back to the 60s. That signifies a drop in our humidity.